Hey YouTube, BM here. Just want to do a quick video on uh, my PH controller. I got it's a Milwaukee Instruments PH controller. I got it probably a month and a half or so ago, but I, I just barely hooked it up. And I wanted to wait. It's been about a week up and running, so I wanted to wait to see how it ran before I actually did a review on it. But I like it. I like it a lot. Um, give you a quick look at it here. There it is. I got it mounted on the inside of my door. Right now it's at 6.8. It just barely shut off the CO2. And what we have here, hang on, let me uh, get my flashlight here. Now what you see is uh, there's two plugs here. This one here in the back is the power. That's power for the pH controller and this here is the power for the solenoid what you're looking at there is that pl the plug that's into the, the, the into the outlet the piggyback right there that's the plug for the for my solenoid for my co2 as you can see it's not running right now it just barely shut off when this came down to 6.8 so it's working very good it it fluctuates uh, it goes up to seven seven point one, and uh, and it shuts it, it shuts on and off. It to me it just takes the guesswork out of it. I mean we can all use timers, and I did have it on a timer, and I was guessing at what the time should be. And I'll tell you if you guys ever uh, if you ever get a chance to get a digital um, pH meter, this works as both, but. You get the meter, I mean, or you can just spend a little bit more and get this unit right here. But you get the meter, and if you ever check your pH different times of the day and night, you wouldn't believe how much it fluctuates, especially when you're running the CO2. Um, I mean, this has kicked on at night just for a short time just to bring it down to where it's supposed to be. And uh, I've been monitoring it. I'm out of work. I stay I'm home a lot, so I am monitoring it closely, and I really like it. I, I think this is going to uh, take the big pH swings right out of the tank. But pretty easy to hook up, easy to calibrate. Uh, there is a couple little tricks to it, but if anybody ever wants to know, give me a shout and I can show you. But this is where it goes into this. It is kind of funny, I thought, how it's a yellow stick. I mean, it kind of sticks out like a morning wood, if you ask me. But it's, uh, I got it hidden in the weeds. You can't even see it. And there's no way you can see it. It's all in the appendage and up in there. I mean, you can if you really look for it. It's right up in there, but. Um, CO2 comes up. Everything's growing in nicely. You can really see it. Look at these uh, lotus. I fo almost forgot I put these bulbs in here. They're bulbs. Them things, the ones in my other tank, I mean, they look like they're on steroids. They're huge. But everything's doing good. Um, <clears throat> I did notice my two angels. I, I got three angels. Two of my angels. This guy's doing real good. He's cool. Loves the camera. Two of my other ones had some shit going on with their. Uh, one of them was like when I bought it. His um, one of his wings there was a little uh, his fins, his wings, yeah, uh, a little bit of rot going on there. So I got some uh, Melifix, yeah, Melifix going on in the other tank. I got them in my 25 gallon, both of them. Get a little treatment. I got a couple of rummy nose in there. Wanted to get more, that's all I had. I got like five, I think. My silver tips. But everything's growing crazy in here. I mean, just... I did get some more Bacopa. I got some red Bacopa. You can see that. That's nice. So I got the red, I got the green. Everything's doing good. I love that lotus right there. That's beautiful. It's a beautiful plant. That cardinal plant. I like that. That's that's a pretty plant. But anyways, uh, that's the pH controller. It's made by uh, Milwaukee Instruments. Like I said, it's pretty easy to hook up and. Uh, Nice unit. I like it. 
I like it a lot. Um, but anyways, guys, that's that. happy with the tank it's coming out nice I like it I like it a lot um, this was set I actually shut it off a little while ago because I was uh... whoops there we go I was gonna film my other tank and the glare in the tank this tank so I shut the light off and I forgot to set it but it's all set now this is doing really good in here this vine <clears throat> except for a couple of leaves up here in the middle and that's it but the rest of them all the way down to the tip doing nice I like that uh, anyways guys thanks for watching